Hi guys, in today's video, I'm going to be talking about three easy to use digital pattern drafting websites. If you notice I'm saying websites, not softwares. The reason I'm talking about this video is because a lot of people are used to manual pattern drafting. And they want to graduate into digital pattern drafting, but they don't know where to start. And going directly to start using CAD pattern drafting softwares can be a little bit intimidating and can make you not to even continue in the learning process. So that is why I advise that if you want to switch from manual pattern drafting to digital pattern drafting, start with these three websites. And the very first one I'm going to introduce to you is called iClue. I'm naming iClue as number three of this easy to use digital pattern drafting websites. Number three, because it's quite easy to use, all you have to do, you need is an email and a password to be able to register. And once you register, it takes you to this place. And all you can do is to just start to create. Of course, there's a cost to it. I do not work for iClo. This is just an information video. That's a disclaimer. But if you're a beginner to digital pattern drafting, it is best you start here because you need a very, very, very simple learning curve to learn how to use iClo. And if you feel that it's still too much for you, I have a video where I talked about an introduction to iClo, right here, where I have a full video. I think it's about a 12 minutes video, how I showed you how to create account with iClo and how you can actually uh, create a dress with iClo. I took you to step by step. This is the video. And I'm going to link this video right here and also below this video so that you can go ahead and check it out and see how easy it actually is to learn your digital pattern drafting. Drafting website that I'm going to introduce you to is Taylor Nova. A lot of people have heard of Taylor Nova, and also a lot have not heard of Taylor Nova. Taylor Nova is also a pattern digital pattern drafting website. As I said initially, the reason I'm introducing you to these three pattern drafting drafting websites is because all you need to do is just to add different sections of patterns to create styles. Patterns that are already in the system, already in the website. All you have to do is to use those patterns to create your styles. For instance, with Telenova also, all you need to do is to register with an email and a password. And with Telenova, you have access to create three free pattern styles. It can be a dress, it can be a you know, a trouser, it can be a blouse, it can be a shirt, it can be a t-shirt. It all depends on you. And once you've registered, it takes you to this page. The good thing about Telenova is that you can create a 3D of your self or a 3D of your figure, you know? And you actually see how a dress will fit on that 3D. And to design with Telenova is very easy. That is why I said, start from here before you graduate to using CAD pattern drafting softwares. Because with CAD pattern drafting softwares, you have a long learning curve and you need to start your own patterns from scratch. So this kind of website will help you to get to know about pattern drafting, pattern styles and all that in an easier way. And then you can graduate to creating your own um, pattern 
styles. For instance, here you want to create a dress, you will just, you know, click on the dress, and then it can take you to this kind of uh, section where you can, you know, change the dress to whatever length you want. It could be knee length, below knees, and all that. And then you have the ability to choose different kinds of necklines, different kinds of back closures, different kinds of sleeves. You know, the sleeves are already there. Just click on it, see all the sleeves you can choose from. Different kinds that you can choose from. So it all depends on you and what you want. And then once again, if this is a high thing for you, you don't want to go through the stress, I also have a video right here where I talked about Telonova, how you can enter your body measurements, everything you need to know about Telonova. I have several videos on it, everything you need to know. Of course, how to start entering, introducing you to all the things that has to do with Telonova, how to even do the measurements and all that. I have a video right here and there are other videos on Telonova that I can introduce you to. Now, the number one pattern, digital pattern drafting website I'm going to talk about is Soys Mix and Match. A lot of people have heard of Soys. Soys has been around for a long time, and I use it quite a lot. Soys is about the easiest place for you to start learning digital pattern drafting. And even if you want to go into the CAD, pattern drafting where you can you know draft your patterns from beginning they also have a cad software but so is cad software is something that's a little bit complicated i wouldn't advise you if you're a beginner to start there i have other cad softwares that i can introduce you to which is what i'll do in my next video and to use so is of course it's also you just need an email and a password and once you've logged in you get to this page now it depends on whatever you want to design you might want to design a dress a top pants jumpsuits and all that or skirts all you have to do is to click on any one that you want to design and it takes you to where you can start your designing of the dress as you can see here all you have to do is to Start with what you want, kind of dress you want. Do you want a semi-fitted dress, fitted, oversized, and all that? You know, whatever one you want. If you click on fitted, it do not ask you the length that you want. You want a micro length, mini length, short length, you know, all kinds. You, are, you want this kind of length. You want a maxi length. What length do you have? Or you want a kind of a skirt and all that. So... So let's say you just want uh, a knee length kind of dress and you click on it. It takes you to another stage where it will ask you how you want the front to be. So you're beginning to get the picture. It's, it's easy, you know. You just go step by step on what you want to create. And then when you click on that, it takes you here to find out how do you want the... Um, one handed dress to be, you want it to be curved like so or like so, or you want it with the hand or you want it without the sleeve. You know, it's as, as simple as that. I have a video where I showed you step by step actually how to do this. So I'm not really going to waste my time to show you how to do this. But from this, you get the picture how easy it is to use. It's really, really quite easy to use, you know. And the reason I love so is mix and match pattern drafting websites because you have a lot of varieties to choose from unlike uh, telonova and ico they have very few um, varieties for you to actually choose choose from when it comes to uh soist soist mix and match online uh, pattern drafting design or pattern to pattern drafting website you have a lot you know quite a lot to choose from see after choosing the top you now they now ask you how do you want the bottom to be you want it to be like this you want it to be like this 
different kinds of uh, you know styles you can choose from. You want it to be a gathered skirt, you want it to be a pleated skirt. You only just to choose what you really want. So let's say you want something like, uh, let me see, maybe I want something like this, you know, an eight panel panel skirt. And that's it, you know. Then how is your back going to be? You choose for many of it as you want the back of the dress to be. And what kind of sleeves do you want? Do you want sleeves? Or do you want it to be sleeveless? That is a part of the sleeves. You want to add sleeves. Once you click on that, you want to add sleeves. I think it will come out with uh, different kinds of uh, sleeves and all that. As I said, I'm not going to go through so much details about it because I have a video on, you know, details on how you can actually do this. See the amount of sleeves you can choose from. See why I love sewist, you know? Different kinds of sleeves you can actually choose from for your style. Different kinds, you know? And the amazing thing is that once you've chosen all this you, you, and, and you get to, you know, download the patterns, you begin to see how this look like so that next time you want to do your own patterns from scratch, you have an idea of how to, you know, do this kind of sleeves and that's your dress. That is your dress. It didn't take me to, <laughs> many minutes to create that. You see? It didn't take me, and it, the, the cost is quite fair for every pattern you create. $2.95. $2 very, very cheap for you to just download and sew for yourself. Unique to you. The only downside is that you cannot sell these patterns. Or you can sew this dress and sell it. You know? So that's it with sewist. And with this, I've come to the end of the video, introducing you to three different kinds of um, websites that you can try your hands on as a beginner. So with that, as I said, I've come to the end of this video. I hope you're going to try your hands on any of these three, especially if you're used to manual pattern drafting and you want to switch over to digital pattern drafting. I will advise you to try your hands on any of these three. As for Sewist, I have a lot of videos that I'm going to link up right up here. And I also link it below this video. I have a lot of video on Sewist, introducing you to Sewist, showing you how to add your measurements in Sewist, how you can actually buy Sewist. You know, I will introduce you to a particular um, software in Sewist that is called the universal software that has virtually everything that you need in one pattern i also link that video here under this video as a closing i also advise you if you're just wanting to you know dip your feet into the waters of digital pattern drafting i would like you to try free sewing patterns i have a video where i talked about how you can get free sewing patterns especially from Mood Society. Mood Society has very beautiful patterns. Patterns that are not common. I'm also going to link that video below this video. So you can get your hands on free sewing patterns and try your hands on it. See how you can put together um, PDF sewing patterns and cut it. And have an idea of how these patterns actually look. Because that will help you when you actually want to start using CAD pattern drafting softwares. That is quite different from pattern drafting websites I've just talked about. Thank you so much for watching. As I said, if you do have any kind of challenge, drop your comments. If you're just starting out as a, a, a digital pattern drafter, drop your challenges, you know, drop your questions, and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Meanwhile, thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned for my next video.